What's going on everyone? Today is Vlogmas Day 18 and I have another tag for you guys. I know, two tags in a row. I just, I don't follow any rules, so whatever. Today I have the Author to Christmas tag and I was tagged by Jessie from Living Within Fiction. Her channel's great, so if you ever want any like writing videos you should check her out. Um, but yeah, so this should be fun. I haven't really looked at the questions beforehand, so I haven't really thought of the answers, so just bear with me. <laughs> Question number one is, what would your main character's favorite Christmas song be? Uh, my main character, her name's Maven, and I think her favorite Christmas song would be... Okay, I just sat there for like a minute trying to think of what Christmas song, but I'm gonna go with White Christmas. It's just a classic. It's a good one. Question two is, pick one of your characters what would be on their Christmas wish list. I'm gonna go with a character named Lucy um, and she would ask for something like handmade, like maybe a hand-woven blanket or something from her grandmother or something that has sentimental value. Question number three, which one of your characters as an adult would still believe in Santa Claus? This one's easy, it would be Lucy. <laughs> Question four is, would your main character drink eggnog? If not, what would their Christmas go-to drink be? My main character, Maven, would not drink eggnog. Um, she would probably drink something more spicy, and I don't mean like like hot chili spicy, I mean like with spices, so maybe like a more cinnamon tea drink or something, uh, or like cider with spices, like mulling spices in it. Question five is, out of all of your characters, who would be the best gift giver? And I think this would be um, a character named Amelia, and she would, well they call her M, she would definitely be the best gift giver because although she seems stern and quiet at times, she's very observant and she knows what people like. She also definitely has the means to purchase anything that she would need. <laughs> Question six is, your main character got a gift that he or she hated, what would he or she do? Um, if Maven got a gift that she hated, Ooh, this is a, this is a, this is a good question. Uh, I think she would just do like what any person would do, would be like thankful for the gift, try and find a way to use it, and if they, if she really definitely hated it, maybe donate it or re-gift it. <laughs> question seven is, does your main character sleep in on Christmas or wake up early with excitement? Maven definitely wakes up early with excitement. There's definitely no way she will sleep in on Christmas. Question eight is, what would be your main character's favorite part about the holidays? Without a doubt, it would be family coming together and just the, the festivities of it and cooking and being together in the kitchen with generations of family. That would be definitely Maven's favorite part of Christmas, hands down. Your main character and his or her love interest step under mistletoe. What happens? Uh, I think that she would wait bashfully for the other person to make the first move, and yeah, <laughs> that's what would happen. She would hate herself after for not making the first move or not saying something, if nothing had happened, of course. Question 10 is, which of your characters would you find in the kitchen baking Christmas treats? This is hard. I would have to choose two characters because one of my main characters, Lucy, uh, one of her passions is cooking, so you would definitely find her, but I think you would also find another character named Kenna in the kitchen with her. I think they all would be baking Christmas treats, honestly. They're such good friends and they would all like plan a day to be baking, but if we're going on statistics here, it would most often be Lucy. <laughs> Lastly, a question for the author. What are some of your favorite books to read during the holidays? Um, I actually made an entire video on this, so I'll link it in the cards if you want to go watch that. But I always love to read, reread Harry Potter during this time of the year, and I just gravitate towards any fantasy book, even if it's like a middle grade or children's fantasy book. I really enjoy that. Um, something about this time of year makes me feel like reading and being in a different world, so that's going to be my answer. <laughs> That's it for my video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I actually recently hit 200 subscribers, which is absurd to me. And this isn't just me trying to act humble or, or be like, oh my gosh, thank you. I never would have imagined. I honestly, legitimately never thought that even 100 people would be watching me or subscribe and think that I'm worth watching. 
and double that amount of people have actually done so and so I am honestly just I don't even know what world I lived it I live in right now so thank you guys so much I honestly my favorite part of this community is being in the comments and talking back to you guys so if you're watching this say hi <laughs> um, but yeah thank you guys for always watching and for commenting and I'll see you guys soon I though I'm going to tag people because that is what tags are all about so I'm gonna tag Amy McLean author and film vlogger I'm gonna tag Ben Sanders and I'm gonna tag JD Archer so I hope you guys do this tag and until next time guys thank you so much for watching happy reading and happy writing